Welcome back to Man on a Beach. I'm here at Carn Beach with Alan and with Enid. Alan, what does the beach mean to you? Well, over the years, our feelings about beaches have changed. When we were younger, we used to just love swimming in the sea. And as far as Cornwall is concerned, we used to enjoy surfing. But now, as we get older and older, we can no longer swim or surf. So we now enjoy the fresh air, the peaceful atmosphere, the fresh air, the ozone, and watching the waves. Thank you very much. And I'd like to add, we used to bring our children when they were very small for holidays to St Ives and to Bule. And we never had very good weather, but they adored it. And then they'd go in the sea and freeze to death and come out with hot chocolate, which was a treat. <laughs> but we did that. Once they'd grown up, we started just going to other parts of uh, Cornwall. The Lizard, the Swarthland Peninsula. We've done walks on both, and they're both really very, very delightful. But you do need sort of good legs. But it, it still has a great fascination for us. Uh, but we're limited now. We have to be on the level. It sounds a bit boring, but it's just lovely that you can do this. Listening to you, I wonder through the generations and the different ages you've described there, what is the common pull of the beach? Sorry? What's the common pull of it? Do you think there's something that attracts people to beaches at all stages of their life? No, I think some people hate beaches. They hate sand. <laughs> I mean, you can have a few laughs. One of our trips to Bude when the children were young, we went with friends and they had two children, but the younger, the boy, wasn't, wasn't a year old. And we took a picnic on the beach and, you know, tried to sit them where they wouldn't get sand in the sandwiches and little Robert was crunching away through these sandwiches and managed to get his hands covered. Uh, well, I think it's like I said, the relaxing and if you do get a sunny day, it's just, there's nothing better. We feel sorry for people who never discovered this area or other parts of England because we love England now and Scotland and Wales and we have travelled abroad so it's not that we haven't a comparison over the years we've, um, you know, we've looked at a lot of things. Thanks so a I lot. think it's better to have them. Lovely it's evening. a long way from where we live. We live in West Yorkshire so it's a good step but uh, currently we can still do it so that's why we're here. Thanks a lot. Alan anything to add finally? Well, I just forgot to mention that when we got too old for surfing, we started walking and I'm a keen photographer. So my hobby on holiday was walking the cliff tops and photographing the seascapes. But the overall attraction to me is that I've always liked the sea. I used to be in the Royal Navy, I used to go sailing and uh, the beach to me and the sea is where I always like to be, to relax. Super, thank you both very much. All the best. Yes. Bye now. <laughs>